Kato guy, my name is Marot and as the game loads, welcome to another randomizer tutorial on the channel. Um, this is gonna be generation 8 Pokemon games, which means Pokemon Sword and Shield and Pokemon Let's Go and Pikachu and Eevee. If you want to randomize your Pokemon Shining Pearl and Brilliant Diamond, check out the other video, link will be in the description, I already made one of those. Um, because the process is a little bit different, which is why I decided to, um, well, do different videos on it. Um, so yeah, this I'm just loading up my Pokemon Sword Sword game, which is already randomized just to see you guys it works. All that good stuff. Um, well, that works. And then, as you can see, the, there's Wild Curlius and then Yamasks or something. Um, so yeah, that is just to see that it works. Now we're gonna stop. Oh, Darumaka, nice. Uh, stop the emulation. That is it. First up, what you need, or uh, I guess a disclaimer. You already need your Yuzu working. This is not a Yuzu tutorial. If you this is first time you hear of Yuzu emulator, uh, go check out some tutorials. There's plenty uh, of how to set it up and get your you know import your keys, all that good stuff. This is just purely how to randomize Pokemon games. So this is Pokemon Shield. It's not randomized. I guess I should. It's fine. Look, trust me. It, if you follow this, it works. Um, so yeah. Uh, in this video, of course, if you've seen my Citra randomizer tutorials, I also like to point out uh, common mistakes that occur. Uh, so, yeah, number one. First mistake, um, or I guess step number one, which you have to do. You go to your emulation settings, uh, go configure, then system settings and file system. So the last, the fourth tab. You have dump XEFS settings right here. So you need to click, have this ticked on like clicked checked yes the, it has to be yes right so that's one of the things uh, that first of all is not going to work if you don't have that thing opened up second you need your game file so i have this pokemon shield right here you right click on it in your yuzu emulator um, you click dump prompt fs and then dump prompt fs now um, it's gonna ask you if you want the skeleton or the full version you just click full version and click ok now i'm not gonna click it i've already done it but uh, it's gonna start exporting your rom fs uh, number one be patient you know just wait it out all that good stuff number two uh yuzu is for like good computers so if your computer can't run yuzu it's not my fault right <laughs> uh that's just basically it um so yeah it just be patient wait it out and when the process is done i'm not gonna do it as i said um was cancelled it's gonna open up uh this file right here uh it's gonna open your rom fs and your yuzu dump folder uh a little bit of you know managing the yuzu files in your app data roaming yuzu there's a bunch of files right here uh so the dump is where everything is gonna go once you dump it i have multiple titles here these are just different games right uh, the c2c uh, 000 is pokemon shield the 68000 um, is pokemon sword and then this one I'm pretty sure is brilliant diamond no shining pearl whichever so yeah uh, basically You need your... Bro, what? My dude, I swear I did it. No, wait, what? <laughs> I guess, I guess, I guess I didn't do it? Question mark, dump. I, I guess I'll do it again then. Okay, never mind. <laughs> uh, so yeah, dump, dump prom FS. I guess it deletes it if you click cancel or something. I know. I guess we're just going to extract it. You're going to see how it works. Uh, yeah, I'll be right back once it does the thing. Or while it's extracting, I have some things to mention. Um, if if you if you're confused about the titles, yeah, Yuzu displays them right here, right? So this is the title name, um, and if you're confused, just check check them out. You, you know, compare the things. And uh, yeah, uh, second stuff. Music in the background is by your boy Saigai. All that good stuff. Um, many shoutouts. Uh, third, all the links to the software needed in this video is going to be in the description and description is going to be your best friend for this video regardless of anything so um and finally i think massive massive shout outs to just yuzu developers and anyone that's been working on here um i'm just telling you how to do it i didn't you know create any of this so yeah uh shout outs to literally everyone that had anything to do with this because it's it's literally so easy right now um anyone can do it literally anyone can do it so yeah um pretty sure that's it for shout outs and all that good stuff but yeah um i'll be back when it finishes 
Also, <laughs> I didn't. I forgot to mention this. Um, since this is actually the second time I'm recording this because my PC crashed. Yay! Uh, if you are new, of course, be sure to subscribe. If you uh, found this video useful, leave a thumbs up. You know, it always it always helps. Um, and if you have any questions, leave them in the comment section down below. I will try and answer it all. Uh, but first, you know, watch the entire video and just before asking questions, maybe try and do it the first time. Because um, from experience, some people just come here asking questions and don't even watch the video. But um, anyway, since we are here, uh, it's this this last part goes fairly quickly um, in comparison to the first 50%. So yeah, uh, we are almost done here. Now, when this finishes, it's going to open up in uh, a new folder. And as I said, yeah, navigating. I, I talked about navigating. Um, no. Okay, I thought it crashed for a second. Uh, so there you go. It opens up the thing for you. Um, and as we said, this is the uh, Pokemon shield version so now what you want to do don't even worry about it so you copy from your dump file you grab the folder with your name as we said this is the c2c is pokemon shield version grab it copy it no i guess i'm i'm, I'm pasting it i i cut it now it's fine it doesn't really matter all that much and paste it um and wait for it so yeah i'll be right back once it does the thing all right so here we are it's almost finished it says 30 seconds it's gonna be less um yeah so now next step that you're gonna want to do um is pknx right uh pknx is software to uh randomize your rom fs uh now here's an important part or mistake or however you want to call it um, you need the right version of pknx and it's not the latest one so if you go download the latest one it's not gonna work it's not gonna open up so that's why you know in the description there's gonna be a link to the right version the one that works um, use that one all right and once you have it you just extract the folder uh, right here and boom boom snap pknx um, open it up now for me it's automatically gonna open up which one Oh, it does open up c2c so shield because i as i said i did it before uh and my computer crashed so it opens up here nice and everything right um for some reason i noticed in well while recording the previous one if you go here randomize learn it bugs it out the entire game the entire pknx crasher so i guess stay away from this one everything else you can just uh true 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 randomize um and then here short sure, randomize everything and save uh wild pokemon sword um i don't know why this is all too false false but let's just slam it to true randomize everything save you just gonna go crazy um but you can play around with everything you know you can just uh tweak little things here little thing there little things there uh at your heart's contempt i guess um it's Hello? Uh, PKNX? It is, it, it bugged out, um, which I, I don't know. Sometimes it happens, you know, I, is it my computer's fault? I don't know. Maybe my stats look, you know, pretty okay. There you go. If you want to pause and check well, what I have going on. Um, uh, huh. Uh, I guess it just it it bugged out. Uh, oh, never mind. There it is. Sometimes it just takes a little time. All right. So randomization. True, true, true. I guess Gen Six. I I uh, no. I accidentally um, put it as false. So yeah. Again, uh, we're just gonna have you know patience is our best answer. I love how I said that, and then I'm the not patient at all. But yeah. Um, just wait it out. Uh, all that good stuff you know we're, we're, we're gonna get there it's fine as we saw um just needs time to process that shit. uh right come on eh, anytime now anytime now i guess this is an opportunity to um 
remind you once again that if you find this video helpful, be sure to uh, leave, leave a like down below, subscribe if you're new, all that good stuff. I am I am going to be playing through Pokemon, uh, the new games, Shining Pearl, I think. Um, there we go. Um, I'm going to be playing through it, so go check that out if you want to see it. It's going to be extremely randomized everything. Uh, or, yeah. Um, also, if you want to see how to randomize those games, uh, check out the tutorial. Links going to be in the description because the process is a little bit different, as I mentioned. Um, so yeah, I, I don't know why it's taking so long. There's something must be going on. Uh, but yeah, usually it doesn't take... Maybe I've done it so much that I've actually just slap them. I don't know why I did this. It's Generation 6 Pokemon. It doesn't matter. But yeah, uh, I guess, you know, we just have to wait a minute. So, have some elevator music while we wait. Come, come, come on, come on, come on. Put the radio on. It's 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 best if I just cut it probably right. <laughs> oh, I did set it. It, it I, I did set it as true. Why was it f false then? Maybe let's just let's just go again just in case. Okay, um, Pokemon. We did those trainers. I think some people say that the trainers kind of bug it out. Um, but. I'm just I yeah you have a lot of options here so just play around with those. Uh, I'll I'll try randomizing this because uh, not responding, but it did it. It it goes it go, it goes through with me. So yeah I don't know. Uh, get Pokemon uh, unhandled exception. Okay, continue. Um, eight ten static encounters. That is the starter. So we're just gonna. Um, sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't, you know, <laughs> just try, just, there you go, and now it works. See, it's it's weird. So I put the first Pokemon as 169, and I think it's number 4, which is the second one. So yeah, uh, so you're going to be 269, and then number 8, no, number number 5, yeah, and you're going to be... I, I have no idea which of these Pokemon are, but that's, the, that's basically how you randomize your number. You just... Um, I mean your starters and okay after you do that that's it we're done you can just literally click the X button right here um, begin X that it packs it all up now go to your folder the one you copied you're only gonna have one uh, just ignore my second ones so C2C that's our shield and these XFS and DramaFS we copied those here so leave those alone we don't need those but uh, PKNX is gonna create a new folder right here wait did I did I do this wrong oh my god of course I did. Which one did it open up? C to C. It did open up the C to C. What? I am I am thoroughly confused now. C to C. But this one's here. It it generated wrong title. Huh? That is just confusing. But I think it should still work, right? It's it's fine. Um, I'll, I'll I don't know. That's I I am confusing myself. So yeah, go back to your dump folder. Use a dump file. Um, go back to and load. Uh, <laughs> Yuzu, load. This is this is where you are gonna need to copy your files. Now I already have a randomizer here um, with RomFS. Uh, so create inside your title file, create a folder, call it whatever you want. Um, and I'm gonna delete these because these are the old ones. And I'm gonna. Oh, it's open. Okay, so let's close Yuzu. Then try again. Okay, um, and then we're just gonna copy these ROMFS into the folder which we just created. Um, there you go, this one doesn't take as as long. So open up Yuzu again. And now if you right click and go on properties of Pokemon Shield, it opens up this thing, add-ons. And you have to make sure that the patch name right here is clicked on, it's checked. Okay, and that's it, basically, that's how the game is randomized now i already i forgot to mention this in the beginning i guess i did but you you need to have a save file already so go play through and save before the starters before doing that because otherwise i think it's kind of buggy it bugs everything out i'm not sure if it works if you don't have a save game no it doesn't work because you need the xcfs file it's it only generates it if you save the game so yeah um you need to have the game saved um 
All right, so, and now, which one do you choose? 169, 269, or 369? 169 is fairly early. It's like after, it's Johto something. Um, so, I guess let's just check if it worked. Uh, 269, Score Bunny is a fire type. Sure, we take the Score Bunny fire type. And what actually we get? We get an egg, uh, which is interesting. Um, but, sure, I, I think this breaks the game now. The egg has been added to a party because I can't, I can't, huh, did I mess something up? I probably messed something up, but I, as you can see, it's not a score bunny. Um, so if you just, you know, be careful with all that stuff, uh, should be fine. Or, yeah, um, and there we go, it works. <laughs> uh, anyway, that is it for me. Um, <laughs> if you have any questions, again, as I said, or, or it, it might be that I copied something wrong um, from somewhere. Uh, especially since the titles do not match all that good stuff so um, yeah because I think this is gonna break the game now because I can't fight I can't fight with an egg or can I I don't know I guess we're gonna see um, let me just click stop recording just in case so my file doesn't uh, you know get ruined so yeah here we are back I started recording again um, Cutscenes, cutscenes, next day, okay, okay. Because I'm, I'm, I, this is purely out of my own curiosity now. How, how, how the battle is gonna go. Um, did I, did I click no? Oh, I did click no. Okay, so I guess, I guess that's fine. Pokemon, do I only have an egg? I do only have an egg. <laughs> See, um, I mean, hatch, uh, Run, run around till it hatches. That's that's how it goes. Um, I mean, I actually, what if what happens if I just? Oh, I can't fight him at all. I can't fight him at all because I don't have Pokemon. Right? Uh, we're having, or do I have to? No, do I have to talk to him? No. Sure. Yeah. Let's go. Let's go, dude. Um, I'm I'm fully prepared for the thing to just crash. Or what, what, what is gonna happen, actually? Because I... Meowth? Okay, sure. Egg, the Kalos champion. Shiny egg. What? What? That is... Is that, is that a joke? Okay, it just ends. Oh, and he wins. Okay, sure. Anyway, that is it for me. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions, be sure to leave them in the comment section down below. Again, description is your best friend for this video. Um, all the links, files uh, are going to be there. Um, again, subscribe if you're new. Uh, leave a like because that helps me a lot, you know, tremendously. Um, and yeah, uh, subscribe if you're... I said that. Well, it's fine. Um, and go check out my Pokemon Shining Pearl Extreme Randomizer Nuzlocke. Yeah. Bye.